I don't think I've had such a large shop in such a long time. I've got my Christmas bits. I didn't have to get turkey or any meats because my mum's bringing turkey and also gammon. And I do have some beef in the freezer. But yeah, let me show you exactly how much I spent and what I got. So in Aldi's I spent £93.09 for non-food items. I did get some crackers. Last year I got the Cluedo ones and they were so much fun but they didn't have any. A lot of things were picked over. I got what I could so I'll enjoy them anyway. I needed some sensitive shower cream. That's for Cameron. He has really sensitive skin. I picked this up. I think this is meant to be a dupe for the Bath and Body Works. Winter cookies. Looking forward to smelling that and see what that's like. I've got some toilet block cleaners, black bags, the zip seal bags for like, you know, things to go in the freezer and stuff like that. Some cold and flu tablets just in case. I don't want to be stuck without them. Toilet tissue, washing powder, dog food and washing up liquid then I got so many potatoes they have their 19p for the super six so I got six bags of potatoes for 19p two bags of carrots I got what I know will go through and with my mum coming down for Christmas and you know how she loves everything just with potatoes nothing else I'll definitely go through them two cabbages and some Brussels sprouts. For frozen veg, I got some peas, green bees, and some mixed vegetables. Fruit, I just got some grapes. I got some pigs in blankets, salami, and these chicken croutons, milk, marge, cheese, soft cheese, eggs, some squash for the kids, oil, two tins of the taco beans and two tins of chopped tomatoes, sweet corn, stuffing, mango puree for Ella, gravy both the chicken and the beef, plain flour, I've got a whole load of juice so cranberry apple and orange, mm. coffee, sugar, a whole load of pops, rice, basmati and long grain and then I've got some pasta as well. I've got these savoury snacks, these were 30% off because the box is a bit battered. That doesn't affect them at all does it? Some sour cream and chive pretzels, yum. These look really good. So chocolate orange, waves and then also the mint ones too. Um, Cameron wanted some cider so I picked him up them. Jaffa cakes, chocolate chip cookies, chocolate coins and two loaves of bread. So I have a bit of a Morrison's haul to share with you. He was manic in there this evening. The week of Christmas is very, very busy. So in Morrison's I spent £17.94. I picked up some of these napkins. They are on sale because it's their Christmas stock as well as this mitten. It was £6 reduced to £1.50. I actually picked this up for my friend Sherry because she loves Robins and it's definitely more to her taste than mine but I didn't want to pass it up. Then I got some mushrooms for 25 pence. I got four bags of peppers. I had crates of these. I picked up four because I'm going to cut them all up, stick them in a Ziploc bag and chuck them in the freezer and then they're ready to go. Four is enough to chop in one go and also store. So they were 30 pence each. Apples, 50 pence. Pears, 35 pence. Grapes, 50 pence. Tomatoes, 29 pence. Satsumas, 25 pence. I got some chicken tikka for a pound, I got two of them. And then I got some of these chicken goujons and popcorn chickens, they were 50 pence each. They had a load of these as well. I just got two because I wasn't sure if we'd like them because I've got a uh, cranberry in it. But it's worth a try, right? For 75 pence, I got two of them. Cocktail sausages, 75 pence. Normal sausages, 69 pence. These looked really, really good. These prawn things, one pounds 50. 
cheese pasta, 63 pence. A loaf of bread, it wasn't this squashed when I bought it, that happened on the way home. 12 pence, some wraps, 63 pence. Flapjacks, 30 pence. Pancakes, 18 pence each. This pick and mix roll pack, 40 pence. Yum, me and Danny are gonna be eating this as soon as I finish recording. This was 38 pence for a cherry pie. And then two baguettes for 17 pence each. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, bye.